is a very common thing uh, for every parent to deny the fact that their child has been detected with autism. And this has happened with us also. So our initial reaction was uh, devastated. We got really got devastated and it was very shocking for us as a parent to know that our two and a half year old daughter has been diagnosed with autism. And at the same time, when uh, the doctor said us about the certain things that comes with autism, it was uh, more difficult to accept the fact. So we were gradual. First, our reaction was the denial, like everybody. We also like couldn't understand why this is, has happened to us. More important, why this has happened to our child. Uh, bad things went wrong. Those were some of the few questions that were running through our minds when we first found out that our daughter has been diagnosed with autism. Then came the social denial, like people around us, our families, they also denied the fact. When we first uh, revealed to them the diagnosis, they said uh, something is wrong, maybe let's take a second opinion. Uh, this can't be, this child is perfectly normal, except that she is unable to speak. So it can happen later on. Nothing to worry as of now. Don't get worried. Those things also we have also heard from our friends and family. But uh, as the time passed on, we realized that this uh, is nothing that will go away if we deny the fact the better it is to accept it and we could definitely see as a parent where our child was struggling at that time she was unable to communicate her needs that was the most important thing she was not having the patience to sit it at a place to do her daily activities she was unable to do anything so we understood that if we keep on denying, this is just going to push us to a more severe situation where we might be under a lot of stress and where our internal relationships that is running all through the family might get jeopardized. So we, we had to accept the fact as a parent, as grandparents or as family as friends slowly we had to accept the fact that our child is suffering from autism and this is a lifelong condition we will have to deal it deal with it in a positive way we are not alone in this journey most important the most important fact is that we are not alone in this journey Neither our child is alone in this journey. We are there to hold our ha her hand and at the same time we have a group of parent, family, our friend and uh, above all the therapist and the doctors who can guide us through this. So that initial um, fact that when we accept that our child has autism it solved our problem to a certain extent because that time we were ready to accept help from others. And when we started asking people for help or when we started interacting with more parents whose kids are having autism, we found out that it is easy and it is better to accept and move on rather than crying and trying to for finding the fault which led to the uh, led to the fact that this child has been born with autism because it's it's uh, there is no concrete uh, reason where, when a child is born autistic what are the reasons we we still don't know so let's not find all those reasons that why my child was born with some autistic features or autistic traits rather than we should accept it and we should move on and we did exactly that as a family and i'm glad that in this journey we have made some wonderful families some good therapists uh, who guided us and who has lended their hands towards us and said like whatever happens we are there to help you out from this so it was a big boost ego booster for us also 
because we needed that kind of assurance from the people around us to go through this. And I would suggest every parent to do that. The first, after the initial acceptance comes into place, the first thing is that reach out to your near and dear ones and share with them your problems and ask them if they can help you in this. If they can't help you, that is also fine. Sometimes giving a moral support also takes a, things become more easy when people support you morally, when people say that I'm there behind you to help you in your difficult times, that makes a lot of difference. So please reach out to the parents. We have also done that and we have got wonderful effects in our life for that. And that is a very good effect, I would say.